Good morning, everyone. On this Monday, as we are counting down before Christmas, uh, the 20th, and as I mentioned the, this entire Advent season, I've been reading some of the readings from the Office of Readings. And today's reading is from a homily in praise of the Virgin Mother by St. Bernard. It is entitled, The World Wait, the, the Whole World Awaits Mary's Reply. You have heard, O Virgin, that you will conceive and bear a son. You have heard it will not be a man, but by the Holy Spirit. The angel awaits an answer. It is time for him to return to God who sent him. We too are waiting, O Lady, for your word of compassion. The sentence of condemnation weighs heavily upon us. The price of our salvation is offered to you. We shall be set free at once if you consent. In the eternal word of God, we all came to be, and behold, we die. In your brief response, we are to be, may, be remade in order to be recalled to life. Tearful Adam with his sorrowing family begs this of you, O loving virgin, in the exile from paradise. Abraham begs it. David begs it. All the other holy patriarchs, your ancestors, ask it of you as they dwell in the country of the shadow of death. This is what the whole earth awaits for you. Prosperate at your feet. It is right in doing so, for on your word depends comfort for the wretched, ransom for the captive, freedom for the condemned, and indeed salvation for all the sons of Adam, the whole of your race. Answer quickly, O virgin. Reply in haste to the angel, or rather through the angel of the Lord. Answer with a word. Receive the word of God. Speak your own word. Conceive the divine word. Breathe a passing word. Embrace the eternal word. Why do you delay? Why are you afraid? Believe. Give praise and receive. Let humility be bold. Let modesty be confident. This is no time for virginal simplicity to forget prudence. In this matter alone, O prudent virgin, do not fear to be presumptuous. Though modest silence is pleasing, dutiful speech is now more necessary. Open your heart o to faith, O blessed virgin, your lips to praise, your womb to the Creator. See, the desire of all nations is at your door, knocking to enter. If he would, should pass by because of your delay, in sorrow you would begin to seek him afresh, the one whom your soul loves. Arise, hasten, open. Arise in faith, hasten in devotion, open in praise and thanksgiving. Behold, the hamoid of the Lord, she says, be it done to me according to your word. Words worth thinking and pondering. Hopefully we see each other soon. Bye for now.